All right, coach, finally get back home. Put a couple goals in the back of that, get a big win across against the Crosstown rival. How's it feel? Well, the key thing is, and I told you this in my last interview, that I mean, it's going to come. And I told the guys, don't chase two, three goals, just chase one. Once one gets in the back of the net, we're going to continue to do what we know how to do well, okay, and find feet. And we did that. We did that, and it really worked. Welcome back to Ian Block. That was quite the celebration after the first goal. Could you tell it had been a long time coming for someone to put one in the back of the net? Yes, and you know that. We've been gone for how many games? Eight games on the road and finally got home. Um, and I tell you what, those games prepared us for today. You know, it prepared us for today and the conference games that are coming. And it's going to come. These guys have worked hard. I have nothing but praises for all these guys. They've worked hard. Start of the second half, Butler got in a couple times, got some clean looks. Uh, Kiever shut the door on a couple. He made some changes to, to the lineup. What was it? How did it feel to have to play a lead and protect and kind of defend more than actually trying to chase a goal? But if you think about it, we've not lost any game when we've had a lead. We've won against Liberty and we're tied against Kentucky. And that's what I told them. We have to throw the first punch. We have to score first. We've not done well when we've been down. And that was our game plan, to get one in and we know we can fight. These guys have been fighting the past 10 games, okay? And, I, you know, Kiva has played an unbelievable game. I strongly still believe Kiva can play at the next level. The, uh, some nice combination play from the forwards. Uh, Yogi got involved, Matt Guy got involved, obviously. Ian put a couple away, Perez put a couple away. Was that kind of the lineup you envisioned at the start of the year? Yes, yes, yes. But again, we've not had the chance to play Perez. He's been hurt. I'm glad to have him back. I'm glad to see Ian Block healthy and actually doing what we have. You know, Ian was chasing two goals. He was hard on himself and he's finally accepting things and look at what he did today. Two goals. Lastly, talk about the play of your of your goalkeeper. One had another couple showstopper staves uh, in, in the second half. And so talk about the kid. Tyler Kiever is unbelievable. Tyler Kiever is one of the players that I'm recommending to the MLS combine. I think he can play at the next level. His height is, is not a deterrent. He can play at the next level. He's kept us in games, and he actually kept us in games today. You know, Butler came out hard, and he did a fine job. All right, good stuff, coach. Thank you.